Hello everyone, welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Thank you for joining us. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more exciting true crime content. Today we look at three crooked brothers that have been ordered to repay more than £1 million after they channeled drugs cash into family bank accounts. The Birmingham trio used their ill-gotten gains from the sale of heroin to buy luxury cars and build an overseas villa. But now they've been told to pay back £1.3 million or face more time behind bars. Sakander Riaz, formerly of Belcher's Lane in Bordesley Green, was jailed for 13 and a half years in 2016 for his part in a £4 million heroin smuggling plot which saw the drug smuggled from Pakistan in children's clothes. His brothers, Asif and Saqib, were jailed for five and four years respectively in March 2018 for money laundering, after detectives found that they had passed crime profits through their own bank account. Some of the drugs money was used to pay off the mortgage and upgrade the family home, and to buy luxury cars fitted with personalized number plates. Investigators from the West Midlands Regional Organized Crime Unit, or ROCU, also found images on Saqib's phone having shown overseas villas under construction, while £80,000 in cash was also uncovered during a search of the family home. And at a Birmingham Crown Court on Monday, February 25th, a judge ordered the brothers to repay £1.3 million or face more time behind bars. They must repay £400,000 in the next three months or Sakandir, Asif and Saqib will go on to spend an extra 36 18 and 4 months behind bars. The rest of the debt will hang over them for life and police can seize any cash or assets they accrue in the future. ROCU Detective Chief Inspector Ronan Turia said, around £500,000 was paid into the family bank accounts despite them having not declared any income. They were making high-end purchases, extending their home and making major improvements, all funded through the drug money and other suffering. Officers from the ROCU's Regional Asset Recovery Team launched a Proceeds of Crime Act investigation into a bid to claw back money and assets that the crooked family had amassed through their criminal enterprise. It's important that police go after offenders even after they've been convicted in order to recoup any ill-gotten gains and illustrate our determination that crime doesn't pay. The money recovered through POCAs is used to pay for crime prevention and crime fighting schemes, plus local community projects. Sakander Riaz was one of seven men involved in the heroin smuggling scam that saw drugs concealed in packages shipped in from Pakistan, including consignments of children's clothing. In 2016, the group were jailed for a combined total of almost 70 years. What do you think about Mr. Riaz's story and the improvements he made to his own family at the cost of others' addictions? Thanks for joining us today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like and a share, and leave any thoughts or suggestions you have in the comments section. We love to read through them all. And if you're new but enjoy UK true crime content, then subscribe to see when our newest video releases. And as always, stay safe.